Okay, so welcome to my YouTube tutorial again. So our topic for this tutorial is about the operation of function. We have here the learning outcomes. After watching this YouTube tutorial, you are expected to perform adding, subtracting, multiplying, and dividing fractions and algebraic expressions in real numbers. And also, you are expected to evaluate the functions. So, we have here to define some terms or rules in this topic. First, let f and g be functions. Number one, their sum denoted by f plus g is the function denoted by f plus g of x is equal to f of x plus g of x. Again, this involved about the, their sum or the addition. So we have f plus g of x is equal to f of x plus g of x. For number two, their difference also denoted by f minus g is the function denoted by f minus g of x is equal to f of x minus g of x. Again, this involves about subtraction. f minus g of x is equal to f of x minus g of x. Their product also is denoted by f times z is the function denoted by f times g of x is equal to f of x times g of x. Their quotient denoted by f divided by z is the function denoted by f divided by z of x is equal to f of x divided by g of x, excluding the values of x where z of x is 0. Meaning to say, our g of x here is our denominator. Dapat hindi pwedeng mag maging, hindi pwede, da, hindi pwede ang value sa x, sa itong g of x is 0. Okay, another is the composite function denoted by f composed of g of x is equal to f of g of x. The process of obtaining a composite function is called a function composition. Now let us try to do this. Example, given the functions f of x is x plus 5, g of x is 2x minus 1, and x of x is 2x squared plus 2x minus 5. Then, determine the following functions. Letter A, f plus g of x. Solution. In this problem number one, recall that the definition of addition of function is just this. We have f plus g of x is f of x plus g of x. So this is now the first uh, definition of addition of functions. So replace f of x and g of x by the given values. Since our f of x is x plus 5 and our g of x is 2x minus 1, just replace the value of f of x plus g of x. So, magiging ang f of x diha, mahimo na siyang x plus 5 plus ang g of x diha, that is 2x minus 1. How are we going to perform that one? You need to combine like terms. So, the like terms here, we have x and 2x. Since kay addition, you need to add x plus 2x that is very good 
3x and 5 minus 1 that is 4. Therefore, our f plus g of x, we have 3x plus 4. This is your final answer for letter A. Okay, next. How about difference? Just like this one. F minus G of X. Recall that the number two uh, definition that involves subtraction of function. So, we have here F minus G of X is equal to F of X minus G of X. Then, just replace f of x and g of x by the given values and distribute the negative signs just like this one so we have we have f of x minus g of x our value for f of x is x plus 5 and our g of x is 2x minus 1 since this is subtraction as you can observe here ito negative sign you need to distribute negative sign to this quantity so therefore negative times positive 2x that is negative 2x negative times negative 1 that is positive 1 so this is now your final answer we have x plus 5 minus 2x plus 1 after distributing the negative sign to d inside the quantity and then need to combine like terms but this is subtraction so we have x minus 2x that is negative x and 5 positive 5 plus 1 that is plus 6 therefore your answer is f minus g of x on that problem we have negative x plus 6 okay another example how about product so multiplication so we have f times g of x solution recall the definition number three the multiplication of functions so the, the multiplication of functions we have f times g of x is equivalent to f of x times g of x again just replace f of x and g of x by the given values how so since our f of x there is x plus 5 and our g of x is 2x minus 1, just substitute or plug in the values of f of x and g of x. So we have x plus 5 times the quantity of 2x minus 1. Next, what are you going to do is multiply the binomial. This is the distributive property of multiplication. We have x times 2x that is 2x squared x times negative 1 that is negative x and also we have 5 5 times 2x that is positive 10x then 5 times negative 1 that is negative 5 and combine like terms in combining like terms we we will come up this one so we have f times g of x is equal to 2x squared plus 9x minus 5. It's because wala na may 2x squared niya kaoban din ha. Just copy 2x squared plus 9x. Saan ang galing ang 9x? It's because we have negative x and positive 10. So 10 minus 1 that is positive 9x and copy negative 5 bakit negative 5 it's only a constant number negative 5 therefore the final answer is f of g of x is equal to 2x squared plus 9x minus 5 okay 
How about division of function? So we have x divided by x. Recall for the definition number 4, the definition of division of functions. So the definition of division of functions goes this. x divided by x of x. x divided by g of x is equal to x of x over g of x. Then, replace f of x and g of x by the given values. So, we have this one. So, our x of x is 2x squared plus 9x minus 5. Our g of x is 2x minus 1. Dito, sa iba pa. This is our denominator. And then, since our numerator 2x squared plus 9x minus 5 is a trinomial, you need to factor the numerator. How are we going to factor this one? So we have x plus 5 times the quantity of 2x minus 1. You need to factor the numerator. Divide by 2x minus 1. And then, cancellation. Using cancellation, cancel out the common factors. Since the common factors here is 2x minus 1, we have 2x minus 1. I cancel na 2x minus 1, 2x minus 1. Ang nabilin kay c, x plus 5. Therefore, the division the answer for letter D is x of divided by x divided by g of x is equal to x plus 5. Okay. How about this problem? f plus g of x is 3. You are going to evaluate the function f plus g of 3. How are we going to do this one? Since this is addition, you need to add first f of x plus g of x. No, we're not check answer ganina na how are we going to add f of x plus g of x. So, I recall lang nato. So, our f of x is x plus 5. Our g of x here is 2x minus 1. Add x plus 5 and 2x minus 1 by combining like terms. So, magiging ito. So, f plus g of x is equal x plus 5 plus 2x minus 1. So, after adding these two uh, binomials, so we'll come up for a monomial. So, we have f plus g of x is 3x plus 4. Dito na tayo ngayon mag-evaluate ng 3. Okay. The problem is f plus g of x is equal to copy 3 then replace x by 3 as you can observe our x here is replaced by 3 it's because ang ipang ang ibutang nini is 3 we evaluate daw nato ang f plus g of 3 so we have this one 3 times 3 plus 4 so Multiply 3 times 3, that is 9. Diba? So 9, 3 times 3, 9, plus 4. Therefore, our, our f plus g of x is 30. Just add 9 plus 4 is 30. Our f plus g of 3 is 30. That's how we're going to evaluate function. Okay. This is your final. Let us try to do this. Let f of g, g be functions. The composite functions denoted by f of g is denoted by f composed of g of x or equal to 
f of g of x. And this process of obtaining composite function is also called the function composition. Okay. Example number one. Given f of x is x squared plus 5x plus 6 and h of x equals x plus 2. Find f composed of h of x. Since uh, our composition here is f composed with h of x, it can, is, can be written also as f composed with h of x. What are you going to do? Since our f of x is x squared plus 5x plus 6, then this one, we can write another function. In composition function, we have f composed with h of x equals x squared plus 5x plus 6. Then replace x by h of x equals x plus 2. Meaning to say, lahat or lahat ng x dito pulihan na to of x plus 2. So, so ang x dito ipulihan na to of x plus 2 squared plus 5 ang x ipulihan of x plus 2 plus 6. Then perform the operations. Since we have x plus 2 squared a perfect uh, trinomial so you need to expand this one to expand this one magiging x squared plus 4x plus 4 so itong 5 dito just distribute this 5 into the inside the quantity so we have 5 times x that is 5x 5 times 2 that is positive 10 and then copy or bring down the constant value of 6 that is positive 6 and then combine like terms so since kay wala na may laing x squared na ha, copy x squared and then our x we have 4x and 5x so 4x plus 5x that is 9x and then the constant number we have 4 plus 10 plus 6 we have 20 therefore this is your final answer so example so we have find h composed of f of x so you need to find h composed composed of f of x so our here so balik taro na po na to. so we have x composed with f of x so our x of x is x plus 2 then replace replace x by the f of x the value of f of x we have x squared plus 5x plus 6 so meaning to say lahat ng x dito ito to x plus 2 papalitan natin ng x squared plus 5x plus 6. So, ganito ang mangyayari. So, we have x, magiging x squared plus 5x plus 6 plus 2. And then, combining like terms, only x squared, wala, wala yung kaoban, and also 5x, wala yung kaoban, so copy. And just add 6 plus 2. Therefore, combine like terms, the final answer is, x squared plus 5x plus 8. So, this is your final answer. Okay, so that's end our uh, topic for this tutorial. Take note that this tutorial uh, composed of operation of functions, evaluating functions, and the composition of functions.